Afternoon folks, I've just come back from low stuffed. Yeah, it's a nice, decent, uh, little, nice little pickup, a 40 quidder off uh, Facebook group, or Facebook market, whatever. Uh, I need a bottom glass if anyone's got one. Be nice to get hold of them in one. The reels are nice. I mean, obviously, the top is perspex, so that's fine. The coin mech is in there. He took it out so he could play it. The cabinet's nice. Okay, a bit of tape he put on for that. The doors. Which I don't need. Yeah, control panel's quite nice and clean. Wheels are nice and clean. All original, I guess. And it's got the wiring diagrams and everything in the bottom. Like I say, what he's done is just... Uh, doctored the switch so you could play it because you can only put uh, two credits on. So, so we'll have a few goes so you can see it running. It's really nice, isn't it? Nice machine, classic almost, I guess. Paper reels, <laughs> but it's proper old. There's no wheels on it, but like I say, the, the glass is absolutely knackered. Unfortunately, but it's working. Oh, well, that's annoying me across. The that's better. Uh, there you go. Nice now respin there. Uh, need five. Hey, jackpot. There you go. How's that? <laughs> we got a jackpot. Yeah, like I say, if anyone's got uh, an original bottom glass, so would have put, I mean, there's no colour. It's absolutely knackered. Nothing I can do with it, really. I mean, the, I mean from a distance, it looks sort of okay-ish. I'm sure someone's got one. Super nice gambler. Oh, another jackpot. <laughs> Happy days. Not bad for 40 quid, is it really? Nice little pickup. Oh, that's what I call it. A nice little pickup. A bloke had only had it two or three years, saved it from an arcade in low stuff. Never thought he'd get rid of it, but he said he's ain't got the space for it. And he don't want to come to my house, does he? <laughs> the reels are really nice and white though, which is nice. Pretty basic, pretty simple. We all know what it's about. I guess for a lot of us, <clears throat> the first kind of machines we played, if you're sort of in your late 40s, early 50s, and you don't even recognise the bell win. Ah. I'm just going to see if that holds. Yeah, perfect. I have. We had a couple of goes when I picked it up, but I haven't extensively played it. But I can see everything seems to be in order. Ooh, even a little bit of real stick. I guess this will go next to 10 up in here. Ooh, we'll hold the eight nudges. <laughs> Mixed bells are always nice for 50 feet. So now I've got the original Super Nudge Gambler and the MPS Nudge Gambler. Ooh, 
it's obviously going to need a bit of messing about with. Well, as you play them a bit more, they come to life. Oh yeah, in case while I'm here, anyone didn't know, I picked this up the other day. Uh, the real deck's at home because I've uh, got it all working. It's a little bit fadier than, but it's actually not in bad nick, this one. I picked up this one locally as well. Uh, this will be a working machine. <clears throat> it might be offered out as a swap. Uh, I, one Super Cobra is nice, two is probably an extravagance. Um, so it might be the opportunity to let someone else have a Super Cobra if they've got a machine to swap with it, a decent machine or something, I don't know or I, or I could possibly sell it but it will be fully working, fully operational on uh, 20p tokens and the big old 10p's or I can alter it to the new size 10p's, not, not a problem but yeah I picked this up the other day, I haven't put it on there because of no point really with not with it not working because then I want to get this one sorted so yeah I just thought I'd <coughs> show that like I say the real deck's at home the real deck is working I've had it running in the other machine so um I'll have a last couple of goes go on <laughs> these, these, are, these are irresistible ain't they there you go uh, Steve's fruit is late, it's fine, and it's a really. I can't get over the condition of the cabinet. Look at it with um, a new bottom glass in this. This machine would be mint. And look, bonus, it's got all the original, the, the original signs on it. They normally disappear, the token one, so it's got all the original signs. It's got the other coin mech in the bottom. So if I can get hold of a 240 volt solenoid, I might even put this back on tokens, on a token payout. Look at that cabin, it is absolutely superb. You couldn't ask for a nicer looking cab. For 40 quid. Oh, come on in. <laughs> These, the, the popper of Belfry ones run really quietly, don't they? They don't even, they don't, they don't even chunk, chunk, chunk. Oh, do we get a hold? Ah. <laughs> well, there you go. Super nice gambler. <laughs>